photosynthesis takes place in two major phases. They are light reaction, dark reaction. In light reaction, light plays an important role. Here, a series of chemical reactions takes place one after another initiated by light. Hence, this phase is technically termed as photochemical phase. The reactions of the light take place in thylakoid membrane which is present in chlorophyll. Thylakoids are termed as grana of chloroplasts. Following are the steps involved in light reaction. Step 1. When sunlight falls on the plant, the chlorophyll present on the leaf absorbs light energy and becomes activated. The absorbed energy excites electrons to the higher energy level. Step 2. This energy is used to split the water molecule into two component ions. It is given by the equation shown on the screen. The above reaction is termed as photolysis, which means splitting by using light, that is photo, light, lysis, breaking. Step 3. The highly reactive ions of water split in two different directions as hydroxyl and hydrogen ions. The hydroxyl ions through a series of steps produce water and oxygen. The water produced may be used inside the plant and the gas oxygen is released into the atmosphere. The hydrogen ions undergo series of changes in dark reaction. Adenosine triphosphate ATP and nicotinamide adenosine dinucleotide hydrogen phosphate NADPH are produced at the end of the light reaction. These are called as assimilatory powers. These ATP and NADPH are used in sugar making process. Let us learn about dark reaction. The term dark reaction does not imply that this reaction occurs only in the dark or during the night. This reaction indicates that it do not require light energy. However, it occurs simultaneously with the light reaction. Hydrogen ions produced in photolysis are instantly picked up by a special compound NADP to form NADPH. During the dark phase reaction, the hydrogen of the NADPH combines with the carbon dioxide with the help of ATP energy in order to produce glucose. This reaction occurs in a number of steps by using some special intermediate compounds mainly RUBP, ribulose, biphosphate and enzymes. Finally, the obtained glucose is converted into starch. During the process of photosynthesis, several proceedings occur in the chloroplast. Some of them are converting light energy into chemical energy, splitting of water molecule, reduction of carbon dioxide to carbohydrates. Once light energy has been captured, it can help the dark reactions to initiate several events, even in the dark, and some may continue even in the absence of light. Light dependent events or reactions are called light reactions and they take place in grana while the rest are called dark reactions and they occur in the stroma. Plants have the capacity to work under any situations such as from very lighted hot dry conditions to wet, humid dim light conditions. The requirement of light and other factors change from one plant to another.